Good morning, Thankful Missionary Baptist Church. My name is Kayla Massey and I am very proud to talk to you about one of the greatest athletes out of Jacksonville, Florida. Shonda Cheeseboro is one of the marquee names in the United States track and field. Her success at the state, national, and international levels rank her among the greatest athletes out of Jacksonville, Florida. Cheeseboro began her career as a standout at Reebok High School, where she played basketball and volleyball, and she ran sprints for the track and field team. She was an all-conference selection in all three sports for three years. As a basketball player, Cheeseboro was a parade All-American and averaged 26 points and 13 rebounds per game. However, it was track and field that Cheeseboro truly found her calling. She was a three-time state champion in both the 100 and the 220 yard dashes from 1975 through 1977, setting state and national records in both events in 1977. In addition, Cheeseboro placed first in the long jump. Cheeseboro also made her mark in the international competition. She won two gold medals in the 1975 Pan American Games at the age of 16, setting an American record in the 200 meter dash for the time of 22.77 seconds. Cheeseboro placed second in the 200 meter dashes at the USA Olympic Trials and won a spot on the 1976 Olympic team, placing six in the 100 meter dash in Montreal. She qualified for the 1980 Olympic team in both sprints, but did not compete due to the boycott against the Soviet Union. The 1984 Olympics in Los Angeles saw Cheeseboro's best Olympic performance, running a leg on two gold medal relay teams and taking silver in the 400 meter dash. Cheeseboro graduated from Tennessee State University in Nashville in 1981 with a degree in health and physical education and became the institution's head of women's cross country and track and field coach in 1999. She has led the track and field program to a pair of consecutive Ohio Valley Conference track championships. Cheeseboro is a three-time Ohio Valley Conference coach of the year and also served as the assistant coach for the U.S. teams at the 1999 Junior Pan Championships. She is a member of the National Track and Field Hall of Fame and the National High School Hall of Fame. My school hosts a track event in honor of her every year called the Cheeseboro Invitational. And I look forward to competing in it April 3rd, 2021. Good morning, Thankful Missionary Baptist Church. My name is Amari Coleman, daughter of Sister April Lemon. Today, as we are celebrating our black history, I will be reciting a poem called, I Am the Black Child by Michael Wynn. I am special, ridicule not sway me. I am strong, obstacles cannot stop me. I hold my head high, proudly claiming my uniqueness. I hold my pace, continuing forward through adversity. I am proud of my culture and my heritage. I am confident that I can achieve my every goal. I am knowing all that I can be. I am the black child. I am a child of God. Thank you, TNBC, and happy Black History Month. 